I'm not even going to entertain the idea of sushi. If I wanted to eat raw fish, I would go to your mum's house. Man, all I can hear is the sound of people trying to finger me. There's a girl at work whose parents both died in a house fire. <laughs> I should. <laughs> <coughs> okay, I've got this. <laughs> What's wrong with you? What are you talking about? Sorry, I keep forgetting you're here because you're dressed as a woman and I don't respect them. Have you tried not having periods? Just get like a big cork and push it up there. My life! My whole life! <laughs> Life is a constant, ever-changing disaster. And if we don't constantly question it, we'll end up comfortable and happy. And we don't want that. Because when you get comfortable and happy, that's when things start making sense. And when things start making sense, that's when we all get bored. And then when we all get bored, we all start doing horrible, sinful things like dressing up like goddamn bunnies on the fucking internet. <laughs> ah, it's probably for the best. Because like I wouldn't be able to look them in the eye afterwards. Not after looking them in there stink guy. You know what I'm saying? My nipples kind of look like if you threw a jar of jam at a wall. Just a big... Pfft. Or a baby. If you threw a baby at a wall. I see the diddlers coming. They're diddling round the band. I haven't been diddled since. I don't know when I'm stuck in diddler prison. And time keeps diddling on. But yeah, what's wrong with uh, what's wrong with talking about cock rings? Can we talk about something else, Mattis? We could, but we probably won't. Giving love to everyone so everyone forgets about the diddlers. We can never forget about the diddlers, guys. They are out there at all times. There are too many diddlers. And I've tried on a thong or two in my time. And uh, testicles aside, it just ain't good. It just feels like you're getting wedged to death all the time. So see ladies that commit to the whole uncomfortable thong because hot bum. Like that bravest people on the planet. It's crumpled foreskin is fucking correct. <laughs> just doing a little, a little dance, a little dance around. Doing a mess around. Okay. I just need to stand up, stretch myself, clip the balls. Good. I'm being molested. Oh, good. I'm literally being raped. And go, I think today I'm going to suck a dick. That's what I'm going to do today. I feel like dicks today. Mm -hmm. I am a masturbator. Where do babies come from? I can answer that. Inside ladies. They've got this, like, flesh purse inside them, and you basically, you have to pee inside them, and then that collects in their flesh purse, and then science happens, and before you know it, you're cripplingly broke. You're a single father, struggling to make ends meet, drawing unicorns on the internet. <coughs> Stand corrected, but it still looks like a dick. <coughs> Why did I do that? Actually, all the charities I support now, I've, I've, I've changed my game. I'm, I'm exclusively racist charities, homophobic, transphobic, all the phobics and all the ists, all those charities, I'm, I'm all of them. That's exactly where your sub revenue goes, guys. How do you feel now? You feeling good? Was that a fucking switch? What's the switch do? Ah! I'm okay with domestic violence. <laughs> Alrighty then. And I said, did you light it and drop it? How do you light it? Like that. Need to stop making pedo jokes on the internet because somebody will clip it out of context, put it on Twitter, and before you know it, Moist Critical will be talking about me. If only women's opinions meant anything to anyone.